What's up, Basil Babes? It's your girl Joy back with another finger. Uh, I'm back out here today. I have an event that I want to go to later, and I convinced Bobby to come out here with me today. Nothing major, just a little run walk. But here's Bobby, she's coming down. She's trying to be her time. Yes, Bobby, look at Bobby. Are you done, Bobby? Sorry. I'm gonna make a lap now. What happened to the four lap? Oh, so this was a speed run. I'm gonna keep going. So what time are you trying to beat Bobby? I don't even know. <laughs> it don't even matter anymore. No, it doesn't. But they run them at basketball, honey. And I told Bobby, now that I'm older, there's certain things I can't do as well anymore. But it's not, it doesn't mean that I'm not going to still try. That's okay. I'll get there. But I've been just enjoying my little walk, honey. I'll run in a little while. I don't feel like it right now. I may not feel like it today, period. But don't tell nobody I said that, okay? And she's off. Bobby, you got the last few items out of your room. How does it feel to be leaving this house? Honestly. Sad. Do you feel sad? I like our new place though, so. But. And your room is bigger at the new place. It, yes. I don't know so much space, I don't even know what to do with it. But. So are you disappointed in mom? Why would I be disappointed? Because we gotta leave. Everything happens for a reason. Maybe we were meant to be somewhere else. Mm -hmm. I don't think I would never be disappointed. What's there to be disappointed about? Got us in there somewhere new, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll just pick up the pieces and keep trying. No sense in wallowing. Move on. Mm -hmm. Move on from all of this. Yeah, and I, I feel like the the new place is it's brighter. I think the energy is better, has better energy. Hmm? Yeah. Mm. But you like your room better? Yeah. It's small. I didn't even realize how small this was. All right, don't worry about the no makeup face, honey. Y'all know I clean up well. It is what it is. Oh. Well, I'm back at the old house. Getting the last few things. Yeah. <laughs> so I guess today will be it. It's a mess take some clothes to um to donate some clothes and let some light on here. A little spooky. Yo. So, I have some good memories, some bad memories in here. I remember when I first walked in to this house to purchase it, as soon as I walked in the door, I said, this is it. Well, I feel a little emotional, but I refuse to cry. <laughs> but anyway, I never thought that I would be here today. It goes to show you that you never know what twists and turns are waiting for you in life. But I feel as though, no matter what they are, just pick yourself up, brush yourself off, and keep it moving. Because stuff is gonna happen. 
It's gonna happen. And I don't feel embarrassed at all. I mean, I had a whole bunch of life changes and stuff happens. And I know if I want to get another house, I know how to get another house. My realtor is like, oh, we're going to be looking in a couple of years. I'm like, oh, we're not. <laughs> because like I said in another video, my goal is ultimately to leave the country. So we'll see. And there's no need for me to buy another house. And that's on my plan. So I have one year before I fill out the application. Um, and it's to teach abroad. See the world. I wish I could go on a journey um, for a year. Um, and my favorite movie is Eat, Pray, Love. And I would love to go on a journey like that. I would love to vlog um, going on that journey and take off a year of just finding myself. Finding out what my purpose is, you know? I kind of feel like I know with the career choice that I've chosen and what I've put in. I, I know, and I know it's to spread my love and my joy to others. I do know that. And to do as much as I can with what I know with kids. So I do know that. And I've been the feeling of the joy and encouragement that I give them. I may not be the greatest teacher in the world, but I do know the energy and the passion that I give to the kids. And it does bring me a certain amount of joy, but it's still pouring me into others. Pouring myself into others. And I need to take some of that and pour it into myself. Does that make sense? So I'm thinking maybe a year of self-reflecting and traveling. The world would be nice. That would be really awesome. With that said, I said I was not crying in this video. Don't be telling people you saw me without my face on child. <laughs> Don't tell people. Give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe, closing the door on this chapter. That's okay. That's okay. Better things are to go. I don't even want to think about the negative because you know stuff is going to happen. So just keep getting back up, dusting myself off. That's all I can do.